Hello everyone and welcome to Crowdin. In this video, I will show you how you can quickly create a term base for your Crowdin project using your source files. Having a glossary is extremely important because it greatly contributes to your translation consistency and ensures that your brand sounds the same in every language. To start using Simple Term Extractor, you'll need to search for it in the Crowdin marketplace and install it. Once the app is installed, you'll be able to find it in your organization menu in Crowdin Enterprise or on your profile page in Crowdin.com. This is a simple term extractor workbench. To begin extracting terminology, you'll need to select the project from which you want to extract the terms. Next, you'll need to choose the relevant files. You can select multiple files for terminology extraction. Finally, select the glossary where you want to store your new terms. I'm going to use my project's glossary. There are two methods for extracting terminology with simple term extractor, traditional statistical and machine learning powered. I'll show you both so you can choose the one that works best for your project. The traditional statistical method is the most commonly used method for extracting terminology. To use it, you'll need to specify the minimum and maximum number of words per term, the minimum number of occurrences per file and in total, and define stop words language for the files you're working with. Some languages like English might have their own stop words like articles, which you might want to exclude. Once you've done with configuration, click Extract to gather term candidates. This app will search through your files and generate a list of term suggestions. To add a term to your glossary, click the plus button. Let's say I want to add Crowdin as a term. You'll need to specify the language of the term and fill in the other optional fields like part of speech, type, status, and gender. You can also add a description of the term and additional details. When you're finished, click add to add the term to your glossary. The term will be highlighted indicating that it's now part of your terminology and available for translators to use. Now let's look at the list of term suggestions from the machine learning method. There are fewer options to specify, just the language for stop words and the minimum number of occurrences. Keep in mind that the results may vary because these are two different methods of extracting terminology. To add suggested terms to your glossary, you'll follow the same steps as when using the traditional statistical method. That's it! You now know how to extract terminology and add it to your glossary using Simple Term Extractor. Don't forget that there are many more features and tools to discover in Crowdin. For more information, follow the link in the description below. Thank you for watching!